your local weather authority with meteorologist Julie Hendricks. Good morning. Another cooler than average start to what will be a cooler than normal day today, but very pleasant weather as we wrap up this work week and staying dry as we head into the upcoming weekend. Rain will return to our forecast as we get into next week and temperatures will be more seasonably warm after we go through the day today. This morning, it's even cooler than it was yesterday morning at this time. And of course, yesterday we started off with that cool feel to the air. Air. Temperatures are down in all locations from yesterday morning. We've got several areas out there with temperatures in the 50s right now. 58 in Terre Haute, 53 in Paris. A couple 60 degree readings in both Robinson and Vincennes. But again, just before sunrise is when our coolest air settles in. So I wouldn't be surprised that they dip into the upper 50s as well. We are literally all clear on the satellite and radar. As you look at this image, you're like, Julie, is there anything even going on? Yeah, no, not so much. Skies are clear, things are quiet, and winds are very light this morning out of the northeast at around 5 miles per hour. This afternoon, our temperatures will be reaching that high of around that 80 degree mark, maybe some low 80s out there. But if you have plans for your Friday evening, as you can see, we're talking about very comfortable summertime temperatures. And even on Saturday with your plans, I think we'll get into the low to mid 80s, but that's still a degree or two shy of the average, so a seasonably warm Saturday. Saturday setting up and a dry Saturday too. Speaking of dry conditions, the drought monitor came out yesterday and as you can see, things have improved greatly after that rain that we had. Remnants of the hurricane changed the drought conditions. We no longer have moderate drought conditions anywhere in the Wabash Valley and just a few dry spots here as you can see across the heart of the area with more rain coming next week. It may again improve some of those conditions once one more time. As we go through the next Next seven days, we will see no rain today or tomorrow or Sunday. So we're going to track those rain chances, potentially a few light showers Monday. This isn't impressive with those chances. Things get more impressive as we get into Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Some scattered showers and thunderstorms are going to be part of our forecast next week. No day a washout, but each day some rain chances in the forecast. As for temperatures, well, we stay with that cooler pattern today. We'll shift those winds a bit and warm things up for the weekend, but we'll be in the mid 80s, so that's not bad for this time of the year. We'll stay with those readings through the middle of next week, but you can kind of see how that heat is starting to expand from the west toward the central plains. And I think as we start to head toward the end of the month, things may start to heat up again. As for today, very pleasant weather, a high of around 81. It will be mostly sunny throughout the day. Winds will be very light. Great day to be outside. I saw a lot of people in my neighborhood walking yesterday and I'm sure today will be another day to enjoy some outdoor activities. Tonight, beautiful conditions, mostly clear. Overnight, we dip again into the upper 50s to start our Saturday. Dry weather through the weekend, though clouds may increase some Sunday. We stay dry. Slight chance of isolated rain Monday, but we increase those chances of scattered showers and thunderstorms as we head into the middle of next week. Temperatures stay in the mid 80s. So no excessive heat or humidity coming. And as far as rain chances go, again, next week before we get those, this weekend looks dry for anything you have going on. Mm. All looks right. Flat.